What's up, Home Skillet? So what we're gonna be doing today is we're gonna be learning how to burn music onto a CD on Windows XP. Uh, so what you could do like real fast is uh, however you get your music uh, on like the Windows XP computer itself uh, and you know download your music, you know, however you do that, do that um, and then you'll have it directly onto your computer. Um, so what I did was I got a more modern computer on Windows 10 because I'm not switching to Windows 11. Um, how I did it was I downloaded it on that computer and I put it onto a USB stick. This has a micro USB and put in here. Um, and so then I downloaded the music, uh, put it onto the USB stick, and then I put it into the computer. I'm going to show you that. All right, so you're just going to grab the USB stick. You're gonna put it right in there. And then it'll show up this window saying, hey, you got a new volume, what do you wanna do with it? You're going to just press okay. What? Make sure it uh, says open folder to view files. Sorry about the bars, I can't really control that because uh, it just frame rates. Um, so anyways, and then after that, you're going to grab your CD and make sure, this is a little tip, make sure this says CD and not DVD because if it says uh, DVD, you cannot play music on it. Um, but it's weird because you can play videos on CD and DVD, but you can't play music on DVD. So that's just a little tip. I learned that the hard way. Uh, so yeah, once you got that, put it into the CD. I haven't tried putting it into the DVD slot right here because this is, this is the CD part and this is the DVD part. So I don't know what happens if you put the CD in the DVD, if that'll work the same or what. But anyways, so once you get your DVD in there, it might pop up a window saying, hey, you got a CD, what do you want to do with it? Yep, right here. Uh, so I'm just going to press like cancel or something like that. Uh, and I have iTunes uh, downloaded in here, so if you... That's how I got, like, how I'm able to, like, listen to my music on here if I listen to, like, CD or uh, USB stick. So it'll just go to iTunes. Um, but there should be, like, already, like, a music program built into there. Anyways, so, yeah, once you've got your music, as you can see, I got the Dirt album from uh, Alice in Chains. You're going to press uh, copy all items to audio CD. Click that. And then as you can see, it has all the music that I downloaded. Uh, and so right here, like, as you can obviously see, it's out of order. I mean, it's alphabetically ordered, but it's not in the order that the CD is in. So, like, wood would be at the bottom. Uh, where is it? Rooster, I believe, is number four, if I'm uh, correct. So once you've got it uh, organized how it's supposed to be, or if you even care, um... Just uh, press copy, and whatever that it's shown right here in this order is what's going to be over onto the CD. So what you're going to do is press copy. I'm not going to because I already downloaded or uh, copied the music onto the CD. Um, so, yeah, it's just going to say, like, the first one. It will be, like, uh, inspecting and then saying converting, and then it's going to say converted. It's going to do that all the way down. And so, like, right here, uh, where is it? Uh, yeah, Iron Gland, that's going to take, like, a really short amount of time because it's just a short little song. Um, so once you do that, uh, it's going to say, like, copying the CD all the way down after it's saying, ever, after it says converted, sorry. So I'm going to do that, and then I'm going to take, where's that, there it is. It's going to pop the CD out, all, like, automatically, or from, it does for mine. So anyways, yeah, so once that's done, you're going to get your CD full of music, and then what you're going to do is you're going to get a Sharpie, and write down the artist and the, the album name. Um, unless you have, like, a printable disc, where it's, like, a, like a real thin sheet of paper or something like that that's already, like, glued onto the top, then you can, like, do, like, uh, that printer over there is, like, a multi, like, uh, format printer thing where it can print like basically anything and uh, there's like a cd or like a dvd um printing slot so i can print anything i want onto a dvd uh so anyways yeah 
uh, yeah, that after that, you're basically done. So I'm going to show you it working. So I'm going to show you that real quick. All right, now let's pretend I'm in my 1990s Honda Accord. Uh, so as you can see, I'm in, I have the CV, CD right here. Um, and I'm going to show you just load. Uh, oh, let's go light up. There we go. Now let me do it. All right, now we got it in there. All right, I don't want to show too much of that. But yeah, as you can see, it does work. It works really great, sounds real great. And uh, yeah, that's my tutorial.